Hello everyone, my name is Soraya Kuhlmann, I'm Miss Universe Germany 2022 and I will show you today my fall makeup look. I will start with skincare. I use a serum to hydrate my skin a bit. And I like to do a little massage to prepare the skin for the makeup. And then I put sunscreen on. Uh, this is a sunscreen with a bit glow inside, so skin is perfectly prepared for the next steps. So now I have the perfect base to do my makeup and I will start with the eyes today. So first of all, I do concealer on the eyelid all over to build the perfect base. And then I will blend it with my finger. Then I will go over this with a light eyeshadow to matte the eye. So then I start with the brown shades. For fall look, I love to use brown shades to create a smoky brown look. And I would start with a light brown to go over the eyelid and create like a line over it. So I start at the outside because they could be a bit darker than on the inside and then I blend it into the inside. For this I'm using um, a brand like Kaya. It's cruelty free and vegan. For me it's really important when it comes to skincare or makeup products to use cruelty and free and vegan products. I'm vegetarian over 12 years and vegan for two years. And I think it's not worth that animals need to suffer that we can do our makeup. Now I'm ready with the first shadow and I will use now a bit darker tone to go over this line again to make it a bit darker. And I will continue with the eyelid and there we'll put something shimmering more into the red tones and a warm color for the fall look. So I will just use this tone named New York. So I think this is perfect uh, for fall. And I will put this on the eyelid directly. Now I will continue with the foundation. And there I use my favorite vegan and cruelty free brand, Charlotte Tilbury. I will just put on a bit. And blend it in the skin. So for me, the foundation is a really important step. So I try to blend everything into the skin and also go over into the neck. So now the foundation is done and I will continue with the concealer. Then I put this under the eye in like a V shape. And then I will blend this with a little beauty blender. And I also like to add the concealer a bit here and here. And I just blend it also with the Beauty Blender into the skin. My favorite fall activity is to go out for work because as I said, the trees are so beautiful, the nature um, had a big change. And I, like, I love to see that. I love to be out in the nature. Now I have the full foundation and the concealer on and I will put on setting powder to matte the skin. So when it comes to powder, it's important to use not that much. So just pull a bit away and then I will apply it over all the face. Now I'm done with the powder and I will continue with a smaller brush doing my under eyes. So I take there the same brown as I took over the eyelid and just apply it under my eye. I just start also from the outside and blend it to the inside. I first take a bit lighter, a bit lighter shade and I will continue with a darker one over it again like from the outside to the inside. Now I'm ready with the under eye and I will continue again with the upper lid to put a bit more color to make it a little bit more dramatic. 
and I just take a small brush and put it only on the outside to make like a cat eye. And then I take a bigger brush and blend it a bit. And now I will go again over the eyelid, but with my fingers, so it makes the color a bit more sparkle and extreme. I just go in with a finger and then I tap it in off the eyelid. So you can use for that look every brown color you like. It's just important that you put a matte tone over the eyelid and a sparkling one off the eyelid directly. So and that's it with the eyeshadow. I will continue with the lashes. So I will first curl my lashes and then I put mascara on. So after the mascara, I will put on eyelashes because they make the look always a bit more um, dramatic. That's always the hardest part because you need to find the right time to put the eyelashes on. I like to wait a bit so the glue can dry and then I will put it on and it hopefully will hold. Glue is almost dry and I put it directly over my lashes. So, and that's it. I will continue with the other side. I put both lashes on and I will now connect with the eyeliner, the lashes to the eye a bit more, just here in the front. If you want that your eyes are looking a bit bigger, you can use a white or nude eyeliner to put it on the waterline. Now I will go over to my brows and I use a small eyebrow pencil and I just draw some hairs at the space where no hair is and to fill it a bit out and then I go over with a little brush and blend it into the skin. So I'm done with the eyebrows and I will go over to the contour and I'm using Kaya again. I go into the contour powder and I start to apply at the outside of my head with little circles and then I blend it into the face. So and I will a bit contour on my nose on the other side. I have my own business in my city. I have a beauty studio. We offer their treatments for body and the face. And besides this, I'm a Pilates teacher and a model. And then I take a different brush and put on some blush. Just a little bit here. And just blend it. So then last but not least, my lips. I will contour my lips with a darker nude shade. So I put on a nude shade, but if you want to make it even more fall, um, you can use also brown tone. I think that would be also great for the fall or autumn season. So and over this, I will put on lip gloss and then I'm finished. And I almost forgot the setting spray I use from Charlotte Tilbury. As I said, one of my favorite brands and I pull it all over my face to fix everything. And this is my final result, my fall look. And I would love to see your fall look. So if you want to try, take me, take Miss Universe. I would love to see your results. And I hope you enjoyed this video with me and hope you see you soon. Bye.